What mm. bothers me about this bloke, that even holding those opinions, he was elected to Parliament, but he is not the worst offender when it comes to sex, sexist remarks in Parliament. There's an MP called Gareth Snell, and I put my glasses All on. All the glasses are going on. <laughs> the glasses are going on. This now, I was outraged when... During, it came out during the by-election in Stoke-on-Trent that Gareth Snell, who was the Labour candidate, who incidentally won the election in spite of making these remarks, he said that loose women were a bunch of squabbling sour-faced ladies <laughs> and that someone called Janet Street Porter <laughs> was a polished turd. <laughs> I know. <laughs> did you did you know at the time that he'd made that those comments? Was this come out recently? Um, Gareth has subsequently apologised, and it came out during the election campaign, and he still got elected. Amazingly, so he's now representing the people of Stoke-on-Trent, even though he said sorry about those opinions. Again, he is a fully grown man, mm. and as I've only been on loose women for a few years, he wasn't exactly under the age of eighteen no. when he made he, them. He has said, "I regret these tweets. Huh. They were from years ago." Oh yes. When I was tweeting along with TV programmes, but nevertheless, I shouldn't have tweeted those comments, and I apologise for the offence they have caused. But as you said, it wasn't that long ago. Mm. I mean, yeah, the other guy, fifteen the last years five ago, years. when he was twenty-one. Um, it, 